Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons and today's problem is which of the following DNA sequences could be the recognition site for a restriction enzyme and here is the answers to choose from and actually in order to find uh, which um, of the sequences can be recognition site for restriction enzyme we have to choose those that would make palindromic sequences probably many of you uh, no such uh, palindromic sequences as uh, Madame I am Adam and uh, you can read it uh, forward and backwards the same Madame I am Adam and here's another example was it a red I saw was it a red I saw but in linguistic and in genetics uh, we understand palindromic sequences uh, slightly different. For example, uh, you see that this sequence, first sequence, let me write it down one more time. So 5 prime end T G C C G T and 3 prime end. If we would read it forward T G C uh, backward also would be T G C so sequence would be the same but this is not how we understand it palindromic sequence in genetics. Palindromic sequence have to be the other strand of the DNA so we have to build another strand of the complementary DNA so zymine would uh, base pair with adenine and guanine with cytosine, guanine, guanine, cytosine and adenine here and here is going to be 5 prime end and 3 prime end here. Now if we read T G C from 5 prime end to 3 prime end here we have A C G which is a totally different sequence so uh, this is not an answer A let's check answer B and the sequence is T G C G C A once again 5 prime end here and 3 prime end here and if we build another complementary strand we are going to get T G C G C A and here is going to be 5 prime end and 3 prime end here so now let's read forward T G C T G C then we have G C A and GCA here and here we have prime end and here we also have prime end so if we would just take the sequence and just uh, flip it over we are going to get exactly the same sequence so this is what we call palindromic sequence in genetics so this can be a site for a restriction enzyme and this is going to be a restriction enzyme type 2 that needs such palindromic sequence and let's check sequence um, answer C that is T G T G C T C T and G C so once again 5 prime end here and 3 prime end here uh, usually all the sequences in genetics uh, when you order primers uh, you have to write a sequence from 5 prime end to 3 prime end even if one sequence would be on one strand of the DNA and another on the other strand of the DNA we have to flip it over and write down the sequence from 5 prime end to 3 prime end so what is it going to be complementary strand of the DNA here G C A G C a. and here is going to be 5 prime end and 3 prime end here as you see we have TGC here and GCA here so this is not uh, the same palindromic sequence so as you see the only correct answer here would be answer C but uh, also you have to keep uh, in mind that you also can choose the answer D or the above because uh, not necessary that 100% uh, of the sequences have to be uh, palindromic 
uh, about 80% of the sequences in uh, type 2 restriction enzymes are palindromic and about 20% are not palindromic sequences. So actually any of the sequences can be a recognition site for a restriction enzyme, but most likely this is going to be a sequence that is going to be palindromic. So the correct answer would be answer B. And this is all for today. Thank you for your attention. Please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day. Thumbs up if you like this video. Please write your comments, questions if you have any. Share this video with your classmates. And see you in the next video. Goodbye.